CCD. Now today I have a special guest. I have Cor Kellstrom, who's the CTO of Concordium. Welcome, Cor. Thank you, Claire. So Cor's here today to talk about the upcoming Sirius release. So I'm thinking let's start with the Sirius release and tell us a bit more about that, Cor. Absolutely, it's, it's super exciting. So we've, we've been hard at work for many, many months now uh, with this new release called Sirius. Um, we're really excited about that. The Sirius release brings um, a major upgrade uh, to the blockchain. It has some smaller things around the smart contracts uh, and then uh, there's delegation. The smart contract framework um, is getting a slight overhaul. So we're lifting some limitations now on the smart contract uh, state size, which is now unlimited entirely. And we're adding some cryptographic functions, which basically means you don't have to code them yourself. And if you come from Ethereum, uh, there will be something that you're familiar with because it's the same ones. Right? Mm. So, so that basically makes it um, faster and easier and, and also costs less gas fees, actually, when you, when you build your smart contracts. But so, yeah, sorry. <laughs> no, but the big deal is, is, is basically delegation. Um, yeah, I wanted to ask you actually about yeah. the delegation. Tell me a little bit more about the advantages of the delegation. So what delegation does is, is basically it allows anyone with a, with a wallet in Concordium to stake their CCDs with a baker. Um, as of now, if you want to make a reward on Concordium, you have to run a Baker node. And if you don't do it, well, you just have your CCD sitting in a wallet. So up until now, well, you have to run a Baker node, you have to have a computer where you run the Baker node, and you have to put your CCDs there and lock them. Mm -hmm. um, and then, you know, uh, there's a chance that you would actually bake CCDs depending on the size of your stake. That must also mean that then people have to upgrade their wallets. Can you talk a little bit more about the wallets? Yeah, absolutely. So, so in order to actually do the actual delegation, you would have to download a new version of the wallet, which will be coming out just after the series release. And, uh, and from within the wallets, both the iOS, the Android wallet, uh, you will actually be able to, to now stake your CCDs with any baker. Um, it also means that we will be providing an upgrade to CCD scan, uh, which is our blockchain scanner. Mm -hmm. If you go to ccdscan.io, uh, you can inspect what's going on in the blockchain. Um, with a new upcoming release, you'll also be able to go in and see what bakers do we have, how mm. much is already staked with them, what's their uptime, and, and other interesting things. Are they actually open for staking? Mm -hmm. You would need to know in order to figure out which baker do you want to stake with, right? right. So, so there's those two sides. And, and I think if going back to the wallets, um, this is just the beginning. Uh, we're currently building a web wallet, which, uh, which we have a pre-MVP of right now. It's built for Chrome initially, but we will be building it for many more um, browsers going forward. Mm -hmm. And that web uh, wallet will allow you, or any developer actually, to, to, build, a, um, to build applications uh, that are much richer and have a much more intuitive flow than, than you're able to do with a mobile wallet. Excellent, thank you so much, Cole, for speaking with us today. So we will be back next week. I hope that you've enjoyed today's episode. And if you want to find out more about Concordium's research and technology, then check out concordium.com. I'm Claire Ross Brown, and I'll see you soon.